Hey YouTubers, welcome to Rise Up with Casey. Let's make some jam. One of my favorite memories growing up is learning how to make food. And uh, here's my first Rise Up uh, food. We, we just got a giant bucket of strawberries. Nice cut up strawberries. That out. Yummy. So uh, I, I, I make jam, a lot of jam. So uh, here's, here's me making jam. Is that fun? The first thing you gotta do is, is crush up the, the berries. Now you can either do this with a potato masher, but I like to use my Vitamix. It, it works out really well, so. In this recipe, it calls for a lot less sugar. Now all of this is freezer jam, so a lot of the things that deal with the cooking jams that can be stored in a pantry, I don't have to deal with. Uh, so this is a recipe that deals with a lot less sugar. Uh, and uh, I actually did a blind taste test this morning with my wife and, and actually my kid, and they both agreed that the the one with less sugar actually tasted better because it tastes more like strawberries than than sugar okay so here here's the next step you you take four cups of strawberries and this is where uh vitamix meat comes in really handy because you just measure you just pour the measure it's really simple okay there we go we got four cups of strawberries now the next part is with the sugar and the pectin. The pectin is kind of what preserves it, makes sure it doesn't go bad. So I I use whatever this is. It's a it's a specifically for freezer jam. There's ways to cook jam which keeps it better longer, but this is for freezer jam. And this way, <laughs> this way is really easy. The other way you gotta cook it, cook the even cook the pectin. And this way, it's just stirring it together. So here we go. Here's the the pectin. Got a. This isn't this isn't going in the strawberries yet. I'm going to stir the pectin and the sugar together. So uh, whereas the the other recipe is uh, more sugar, a lot more sugar. Than, than strawberries. This one is only a cup and a half for four cups. And, and honestly, it, it tastes a lot better. It tastes a lot more like strawberries. So I'm just mixing the, the pectin and the sugar together. All right, and then it's a simple matter of getting the sugar and pectin mixture into the strawberries. All right, so I'm done with the, the three minutes of stirring and, and now it goes in the jars. That's, that's all there is to it. And there you have it. That, that's all it takes to make uh, strawberry jam. 
takes around maybe 10 minutes a batch this way. The other way, you know, if you want, if you want more sugar, that's the way to go. But honestly, with the less sugar, you get a lot more of the strawberry flavor and, and it tastes a lot better. So there we go. And these will sit around for a good half hour and then they'll, they'll end up in the freezer. All right, so another thing we like to do at our house is make strawberry syrup. This is great on pancakes, waffles, and what my kids love especially is putting it on, or putting it in milk to make strawberry milk. Much better than that stuff you get at the store, the powdered stuff. This strawberry syrup goes really, really good with milk. And it doesn't take a lot of ingredients. It just takes some water, some sugar, and some strawberries. All right, so it just takes some, some strawberries. water and sugar and so before, before you can pour it into jars to to get it frozen it needs to chill a little bit first so here it is going into a bowl and, uh, and then it's into the freezer to, or excuse me the fridge to chill for a few minutes Hey YouTubers, this is the, the finished product. This is what you get out of five gallons of strawberries. That is a lot of jam. Actually, we made, I guess we made some syrup too. So we got jam and about 13 jars of syrup. Um, it's gonna be some good eating. Are you excited, Patrick? Yeah. Are you excited, Anna? Yeah. Are you excited, Mommy? All right, there we go. We got the jam. All right, YouTubers, just remember. All right, YouTubers, just remember, you guys can do anything. Nothing's impossible. You can grab some yeah. berries and, and make yourself some jam. Much better than store-bought. Have a good one. Remember to like and subscribe. That way I can keep making more awesome videos. Guys, have a good one.